if someone performs an outstanding humanitarian act are you not going to be inspired with that are you not going to take some message from that particular action into your life or are you going to check and research which faith and which religion this person belongs to lot of us could be in this particular state where because someone did not follow rightly someone did not speak right or did not act right or due to our bias and prejudice mind we have forgotten the greatest humanitarian act the greatest act performed by jesus to show us how god loved us it wasn't a christian act it wasn't for catholic and for christians it was just for everybody for the entire humanity to express how much god loves us and the greatest action performed was that on the cross it wasn't to make someone christian it wasn't to make someone convert their faith but it was to connect them to this loving god to have a new understanding of god because of someone who did not follow right who did not preach right who did not speak right or without categorizing this jesus that his act is only for christian are we going to keep this greatest act or this outstanding act out of our mind if any of these have made you to go away it's time to come back to god it's time to understand once again the love of god expressed in this real face of jesus keep those other people aside who have not led you rightly focus yourself on this greatest act of giving all that he has right unto his death he poured out all the blood that he had and not just poured out cutting himself but poured out in the entire suffering inflicted on him mary is being presented in today's gospel when jesus is at the meal at the house of lazarus mary it is said anointed jesus feet with a pound of costly perfume and then wiped them with her hair and judas is carried who betrayed jesus questions could we not use those money to reach out to the poor or for some better purpose now understand mary performs this act which is quite scandalous in the jewish tradition one could not even leave the hair loose as a woman in public and she is at the feet of this holy person but understand mary she doesn't care she doesn't mind what people are going to see what people are going to think it was just an expression of her utmost love for jesus it's like my heart sees jesus and nothing else or no one else mary did this greatest act an act of love with this costly perfume what do you wish to do what do you want to do in response to this love of god express in abundance in the special holy week lot of our brothers and sisters are going to take initiatives try their best to be more holy to be closer to god let us see what can we do how much we can have that love of god instilled in us and get little more closer to god